Welcome back, everybody. This is Slowly Newt. We are on episode five of my walkthrough, and we're still here with Foreign Guard, um, selling our potions and buying soul gems. Um, this should be the very last one that I need to get, and make sure when you're buying your soul gems that you're buying just the filled ones, unless you really want the empty ones. That's up to you, okay? Um, just wanted to do a quick reminder on that. And let's go down. And we got four potions left. Nope, this won't be the last one. But you know what? I can make it the last one because... Nah, we'll go one more time. I don't know if you heard. The Yarlbau group said my work is a priority, which and means you should help. I'm being attacked. And then load. And you know it's going to be loud. That's how PlayStation is playing today for me. I can't get it adjusted right. But can keep their voices at oh. level. I thought Big you were level. already on your way to boot. Hmm. So I had you figured for a mage. I think you'll appreciate this. This should be the last. Common, grand, greater, greater, lesser, and petty. Okay. He's got four thousand, and we've got two potions. One, two. All right, we are done here with Fire and Guard, okay? So once we clear here, um, we are going to go back to Emershard Mine, find the ore out of it, and then we're gonna go get the transmute spell at another mine so that we can switch the iron ore to Silver ore, then silver ore to gold ore. So, let's go. Off to Bleak Falls Barrow yep. with you. The Jarl is not a patient man. Neither am I, come to think of it. Well, you've been patient for the past two hours. So, that's no problem. I took breaks in between it, so I didn't push it really hard. Um... But I did finish selling everything, and I got an achievement uh, for breaking 100,000 gold. Um, all right, we're out of here. We are going to Riverwood real quick. And, you know, we could just go down to the Standing Stones. Yep, 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 and yep. Gotta love this game. I do. It's a lot of fun. There are boring sections to it if you play it exactly the way I'm playing it. Um, and tedious ones, so uh, we are still on the Thief. Stone, okay, and that takes up your um, sneak skills, okay, you can do sneak attacks, your sneak itself, uh, so on and so forth, so, um, and then we've got the maid stone here in the middle, and then we got the warrior stone, which helps your fighting skills or your combat skills. Um, so I'm thinking 
Warrior Stone right now because we are going to be doing some fighting combat and then we're going to go into sneak mode. Don't forget to equip your weapon. Okay, we've had it off for quite a while. Uh, you can go to the Steel Mace or the Steel War Axe. The Steel Mace gives you more damage. So that's what we're going to. Um, and don't forget to learn those books you bought, the spell books. Already no flames, buckle, soil trap, and stone flesh. Okay, you got all those. There's the treasure map. Um, one, and that's across the river. We'll get that after we get done here with the um, at the mine. And did I pick up? Let me do a quick check. I think I was in there earlier. Uh, yeah, I, I picked up a pickaxe already. So, just wanted to verify. So, there may not be anybody on the outside, but I uh, only went in so far. So, we're having fun. But they do respawn. And there is an anniversary edition mission. Now ain't this a surprise? Yeah, clunk, you're dead. Okay. Uh, take your gold, your lockpick. Uh, do I really want a 10 for 45? No. Because I'm already at 282 pounds out of 420. What am I carrying? That's that pedigree. Oh, I've got the Elven Armor, which is Light Armor, and it's 39, I can wear that over the um, studded. And then we got very few potions, very little food, very little books, but we do have a whole bunch of soul gems, okay? We're well over a hundred. We've got one, two, three, four, five, over 500 soil gems on us. Um, so, when we start enchanting, and we'll be enchanting um, daggers and huh? rings occasionally as needed. And then you can also. Uh, Don't like the looks of this. Yeah, well, you know. We're going to deal with it. Now I'm going to pick up some ingredients. What were you thinking? Thought you never saw me pull that ace out of my boot. What was that? Over here! Never should have come here. <laughs> Wrong button, dude. I was trying to go back into first person from third. All right, let's, um, I don't remember if I, no, I didn't mind this. So we're gonna mine as we go through. And kill everybody. Because we want the iron ore. back and sneak, out comes the weapon, then we strip them for what we want, okay, and, okay, all right, and lock pick, 12 for 55, not worth it, if you were going to use it as a personal weapon, it would be worth trading, but we're not, come down here and get the purse again, and hit the mushrooms. And his journal says that he was a little upset because they, um, and all, thank you. He was a little upset because uh, they wouldn't sh shear up the mine when it was an active mine. So, uh, that's 
empty, okay. We're gonna flip the lever and go, go, go. I do believe I came this far. Yeah. Because there's nobody here. Now they're used to hearing picks. Oh, I forgot. You can't. You can't check things to see if you can. Um, mine it when you're in sneak mode. Bad times. And kill him. <laughs> you picked a bad time. For what? To get lost? Nah. It's never a bad time to get lost in a mine. And a slow jam. Scroll. And over here. Cool. Um, then we can go down. Drop straight down from here. And wow. kill him. Would you look at that? <laughs> Alright, stink increased. And that's about it. And open the book. Take everything you can take. This is a fishing location, just to let you know. That's why this is here. And do we have a fishing pole? No, we don't. So we'll take the fishing pole. <clears throat> oh, my sneak must be pretty good because they haven't spotted me yet. Is someone there? Can't hide from me. Got the best. <laughs> Bendal got him. Good job, bro. Good job. Okay. Jug of milk? Nah. Rock pick. We'll take the arrows though. Alright. That should be it for people here. We are going to go around. And get the other chest. Over here. And the bag. Oh. Consistently working on our lockpick. And... And back around for the crate again. Uh, I'll take that. And then double check to make sure we're not missing anything out here. Back in the hole. Get the crate. More gold. Potions. Old. See, we were gone long enough that it all respawned, and uh, now we're going to go back around. There is iron ore right here. Almost forgot that. 
And if you don't know where they're all at, I will show you as we go. You're going to get nine hits off of this, and then it's depleted. So, and then back around. Okay. Double check in here. I don't remember if there is any in here. I don't think so. Um, come on down. You've already stripped them. And as long as you're tapping the wall periodically as you go down, you can uh, get the ore. Come on up here. This is the back entrance to the cave or to the mine. anymore I gotta see the sky rim here in a second okay anything else in here double check hit the walls okay down and around hit the wall okay I didn't think so Lots of fun, lots of fun, guys, lots of fun. Um, I don't remember if there's any down here. I don't think so. Uh, just this one right here. Uh -huh. I forgot about that one. That's why I check. You got to get all the iron ore that you can get, especially when you, you're doing um, transmute. You know, just switching over from one uh, so that you can get as much ingredients as you need to um, make things we are going to be working on smithing we're going to be working on a few different skills uh, let me check it uh, okay good to go don't forget the gold here where they sleep. And that's for the mine. Mine this area here. We are heading back out. And grabbing our gold as we go. Or uh, our iron ore as we go. Which we're going to transform uh, it into gold ingots. And then we're going to be doing some smelting. So now just take your time, check the walls, make sure you're not missing anything. Oh, there's some. That's why I always carry a pick on me. Now we did miss and leave the ones down by the uh, river, by the standing stones. We can go back and get those though, that's no big deal and then we'll um, fast travel back to the house and drop off all these um, soul gems so we got more room for our iron ore Yeah, you get nine swings on regardless of whatever component you're getting um, and it'll run the vein dry a lot of people don't know that um, so all right back out i'm gonna check to the left i'm almost positive there's none over here a liar out of myself <clears throat> and then when we get to the other mind we're going to uh, where we get the uh, spell we're going to mine all the ore out of there as well that's why I need to make space so that we got carry space to um,
carry everything. I've been up here. Okay, yep, yep, it does. Okay, back out. And then back across. And straight out. We already got the ore down there. And then catch it up here. Don't forget there is a trap here. You don't want to trigger it. It's a rock trap. That's why I go around. And a lot of times I'll go through and trigger it just to, especially if I'm by myself, trigger it to uh, get it out of my hair. All right, back to sneak mode. down him you have good to go all right we're gonna go down and get that other ore and then we're gonna go to the house which is near watch for right now could have waited till I got up here to get a fishing pole but uh, I didn't there has been a time or two that there hasn't been one over here why I don't know the game just didn't spawn one all right here's the R I got the master game sound turned down just so that you guys know and but there is one here now and then there's a book on fishing Find the lines and lower. If you want to pick it up, go for it. Um, there are locations across the river there, over on that side, that has ore in it, but we're not going over there. And I am coming up to the standing stone, and then we're going to fast travel to the house, like I said. No, we're not going to Big Falls Barrows yet. Our burrows yet. Doo, doo, doo. And I'll show you. I don't remember if I did. I think I did show you guys where I store all my soul gems. Uh, unless I've got a weapon that I need to carry some. Huh? Recharging. Um, but that's okay. Now we are going to use a couple glitches here. Um, well, a couple meaning um, the restoration glitch when we start while we're enchanting. Once we get enchanting done, and then gotta love that it just dumps every time all right right here I've already put some in so now we go down to miscellaneous store 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 and store so all we're carrying now is 141 pounds. We've got um, 29 iron ore, two iron ingot, and then gems. And we've got a bunch of gold. So I use this. Oh, let me see. If, did I use it or did I switch over to this to this uh, strong box? I switched to the strong box, okay. Uh, put our gems in. Which made us a smidge lighter, but that's it, okay. Um, I'm gonna get rid of that one piece of armor. Now 
here's one other thing you guys need to think of too is we're going to need four sets of armor uh, I would recommend getting four different sets but you can use the same set all you want um, and I put enchantable items in covered here already got one ring there and I got another one okay so and then we've got um, silver necklace up there and the gold ring over here everything does come move back when you leave so it's no big deal so now we're going to go fast travel to um, the stables at White Run. And then we're going to head out to the other mine we're going to go to. Now there is seven places, should you desire to do them and want to see them, <coughs> leave a um, message in the comments section for me. And I will go around White Run and show you where they're all at. There's seven different mining locations around White Run. Uh, and there's one conundrum, as it's called. Um, mining location. So now we're going to head this way. Might as well go back in sneak mode. Got to remember we're under the warrior stone right now. So. That sneak is going up. That's good. Got to love the lightning. Doo, doo, doo. All right, let me get rid of that. Marker driving me nuts okay so we talked to foreign guard we're not close enough let me show you on the map where we're going to go it's approximately right here okay is where we're heading um, and it's a bandit camp and there's two ways into the mine one way you'll fall down and possibly get killed and then the other way is fighting the um, bandits and you might get killed there too so I mark it perfectly straight ahead alright I don't trust I don't trust that eye. Um, oh, this could be, nope, that's a elk or a deer, one of the two. Um, as you can see, we're red to the markers right on it um, or in front of it. If you remember, I did um, removing the marker since we're so close. Um, I did tell you guys that I turned down the game sound. Uh, the master's down low, and the sound effects are down low, or actually down low, and. Um, Voices all the way up. You picked a bad time to get lost, friend. Looky here. Oh, no, Looks I like didn't. we got ourselves a hero. 
See you in pieces. That's all you've got. I'll kill you when I have to. Okay. Health went down, but that's no problem. Uh, damage is sixteen. What's uh? What's our bow do? Damage is 12. Well, we'll take the 16. And then of course we take the steel arrows. Leather armor is one of the ones that I'm going to use, so I'm taking that. Uh, don't forget there's a crate over here. It's the apprentice. Um, Lockpick. No. 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 Ten and two. Ten and two for lockpicking. Gold, gold necklace. Okay. And there's one more here. But we're going to hit the bodies first, and while we're healing, take the skill arrows, lockpicks. Uh, I already got a skill dagger. Don't need it. Uh, come out here. The rock pick. Okay, don't need to steal a dagger. Where's that orc at? There he is. Thought he was special. Special Ed. He was tough, don't get me wrong, but he wasn't that tough. All right, we got one more crate to get. And I do believe that one's right over here. Yep, and it's got a trap on it, so we're gonna pick the trap, trap, pick the trap off. Um, all right, it says it's to the left. Nice and easy, Newt. Nice and easy. And when we get this done, um, we will uh, start doing the spells. All right, back into sneak mode. Now this camp will spawn, respawn, just to let you know. Oh. And so, so will the gold. Okay. Um, we've got a guy up here that we're gonna kill. Is someone there? Okay. And hit him up. Now we do need heavy armor, and he does have a complete set of it. That's one of the ones we're gonna need for when we do uh, our uh, other skills. Might as well go ahead and mine, mine while we're here. Don't waste the time. Because everybody in the mines used to hear pickaxes go anyway, so it's not going to trigger anybody. Uh, 
And if we have to, we can give uh, Fendal some uh, stuff to carry for us. Now that he's our mule. And just to let you guys know, he has an unlimited amount of carry weight if you tell him to pick it up. If you don't tell him to pick it up and hand it to him, he has a very limited amount. And uh, so your best bet is to tell him to pick it up in order to use the glitch. And that's, that's a glitch in the game. Um, I don't know how many of you know it, but it's the same glitch that's in Fallout 4. So, um, Bethesda didn't really um, fix that in either location. Alright. Uh, we got over here. The um, get the um, mushrooms. Couldn't think of them for a second. I'm losing my mind. And no, I'm not going to sing for you. We should have mine right here. All right, get the wall in front of us. Don't like the looks of this. Yeah, I know you don't, bro. Nothing I can do about it. Uh, other than quit mining iron ore, uh, and you can do it after we kill everybody, but uh, we're not going to do it that way. We're going to go ahead and get it, because they're used to hearing pickaxes. So, I'm going to pick all I can, and then kill, kill, kill all I can. So. Make sure I got this area. Out comes the mace. Gotta have a sharp axe to cut through all that fat. Hurry up, right. we've got a merchant. Huh? Is someone there? Take her out first. Victory is yours. No one passes an orb. Take me a potion. Chief. Orc battle axe, 21 damage. I'll take it. Uh, steel arrow. Steel armor and boots. Nope, don't need it. Uh, Vendal survived. So, we'll go ahead and get the gold up here. Potions. I know I took a plate, no big deal. I can drop it later. I don't use the plate glitch. Uh, I could, um, but uh, there's a poultry's axe. There's more than one of those in the game. 
just let everybody know and don't forget about the chest in the back back here a lot of people do um, all right we're 272 on our weight granted I'm um, Of mine, and then the uh, transmute spell is uh, right up on that desk or that table right in front of us, which is the whole thing we came here for that and the ore. And uh, then we're gonna kick it in the rear. All right, there's the spell, okay? Take it, uh, take the gold. Any potions you want to take, uh, or and there is corundum right by the bed. So we will have fun doing that, <coughs> and then hit this chest. We'll do the beacon. We do have an elven bow, though. Um, a new back. hand touches the beacon. Listen, hear me and obey. A foul darkness has seeped into my temple. A darkness that you will destroy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll Return just my beacon to Mount Kilcreath. And I will make you the instrument of my cleansing light. Well, I appreciate that, but I don't really want it. Um, hit the vein here. So, now we got that quest to do. I could have left it. I've done it before. I've walked away from it. But uh, it's content, so we're going to do it. And it's uh, it's a lot. I enjoy doing it. Now, you got to be careful over here. Because if you hit that um, trap, <coughs> you could get killed. So, and... Fendal, I believe, will hit it. He may not. He may go around it. Since I went around it. Uh, where is he? is he? He's right here. Okay, good. He went around it. And then he goes. Deactivate the bear trap. Uh, double check the mine walls. And there is ore here. He must have a itchy back, wanting me to scratch it with the pick. <laughs> but uh, what can you say? No big deal. Okay, that's done. And this goes to the second opening, their trap opening. I'll show it to you. Um, and you can get the gold purse here. Search the elf, take the lockpick, grab his body, move him out of the way. And then crouch. And there is another coin purse up there. Uh, we'll search the deer. And then I knew I was going to hit it. Wait. So we're gonna wait an hour. Get our health back. Um. Uh. Uh. Okay, got it. 
and then back in. And double check everything on the way back out. Make sure we got all the uh, orange stuff. He's going to hit it. I know he is. Nope, he missed it. Okay. Missed one. And then we're going to get the uh, mammoth tux over there on the shelf. And get out of here. Alright, that should be it. Might as well take the snaps too. We can, it is food, so we can cook it. Uh, double check, make sure we got this one under here. Yeah, we did. Okay. All right, that should oh. be should be all of them. Okay. So back out to. Oh, missed one. That's why I'm double checking. Um, we'll head back to the house and uh, transmute everything. Uh, actually, we're not. We're going to go to um, White Run and transmute everything. Uh, and that will take a little bit of time, but that's no big deal. Um, I know I got everything up here. Got this one back here. This over here, got that there, missed the trap, and that's it, okay, out we go. All right, everybody, we're going to call it a video here, okay, um, it has been 47 minutes, and... I said I would try to keep it as close to 30 as possible, and I'm 12 minutes or 17 minutes over. But uh, I didn't want to break the video up on doing the mine, and then um, go on from there. So I want to thank each and every one of you for being here today. Um, I will see you in the next, and then we will work on the transmute spell. Uh, transmuting all this iron ore into uh, gold, which will also level up a skill. And then we will um, be smithing, okay, and getting everything there up to um, level 100. Then we will uh, do our. Uh, Enchanting, get it up to a hundred, and then we will enchant armor and various other items as we go through the game. So, um, and we're going to deactivate the break of dawn, so and go from there. Um, so, again, thank you all for being here. Uh, please leave a, a like on the video, give it a thumbs up, uh, comment if you know something I don't know that I missed or so on and so forth, um, as well as uh, share it with a friend, okay, if uh, you really enjoyed it. Um, I will be doing this videos on the playlist, it'll be growing all the way to the end of the game. I am going to try to stick as close to um, the main game as possible and getting all of our uh, skills up to level 100, becoming level 252 and unlocking all 251 uh, skill points. There is an achievement for that. So I want to make sure I get that and uh, we probably will be doing various little other missions 
on the side that we have to do, like um, getting uh, words of power, so on and so forth. But that that I consider is part of the main uh, game. So with that being said, I want to thank you again for all being here. And I will catch you in the next. Have a good day wherever you are in the world. And I will catch you on the next one. Thank you.